Yeah, I'm in the middle of two and a half weeks now, so um, really, really enjoyable. Um, I suppose initial uh, reactions is just love how uh, receptive the players have been to some of the new things that we're trying to bring in and layer for this season. And to be fair, uh, really loving how, how quickly they learn. From that point of view, we've been able to hit the ground running. Um, there has been no easing our way in. We, we've been training fast from day one. So from that point of view, it's a real good continuation from where the boys finished last year and where we want to push on to this year. Simply, I'm a resource coach for the individuals and the players, and I'm a resource coach for the coaches themselves. Um, ultimately, my job is to help get the players better um, in line with what the coaches want to achieve on the pitch. Uh, I suppose it was a special time, yeah. Um, I suppose back then when you're in the midst of it, you don't really think about it like that, but I suppose reflecting over the years, it was uh, unbelievable experience to be involved in two European Cup squads and uh, the things that we learned throughout from the players themselves and the coaches we had over those couple of years. I mean, I suppose that's the reason why I'm coaching today. Um, if you look at some of the top coaches in the world, Paul O'Connell, Ron Nogara, Jason Holland, all came from that crop. And you have Dennis here as well, Mike, Andy, all came through that group too. So to say that was a great learning experience for me as a player, but also I suppose the nuggets I took along the way for my coaching journey. Yeah, most definitely, yeah. I, um, I suppose throughout the years of my years at Munster and when I went to England for a time, I, I've been exposed to some top coaches in the world. When you look at what was here in Munster with Declan and Tony McGann and, and Alan Gaffney, it's, it's hard not to pick up, I suppose, what they taught us over the years. And, and to be able to implement that, I suppose they've got a, they were a massive factor in I suppose how I coach today. Um, you've also then layer on the players that I played with. Um, it was just a great experience, and I suppose it was always an inevitable that we transition into into coaching. I'd done um, a year, four years with Art School, and and always worked with Munster kind of underage teams. But I started with UL Bows, uh, working with the academy here in the college. Um, and that put me in good stead for to make the step then to the Connacht Academy where I spent six years before I turned pro. It's a good place, I have nothing but fond memories, um, but I suppose uh, this year was the right time for me to come home and, uh, and right time for my family also.